Good morning. It is Tuesday and I just got done editing two vlogs and yeah, now I decided to start the vlog because I'm done editing the vlogs. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to get my hair done today. I'm going to get it straightened and washed and deep and conditioned and cut. I'm not washing your hair. I already washed your hair yesterday. So this is the first time I'm getting straightened in over two years. I think it was December of this year is 2020. No, this year is 2022. I didn't straighten I think it was in 2020, December of 2020, when I cut it off, when I chopped it all off, and it's been curly since then. So this December, I think, will make two years, if I'm not mistaken. So, yeah, I'm excited about it. Um, hopefully, she, maybe she can give me some type of treatment and stuff for, you know, my shedding and all that stuff. Uh, but, yeah, anyways, the kids are at school. Well, the boys are at school. Nova's over here on the counter, sitting on the counter, looking at the hydro something something plant thing that TJ bought because he's trying to grow some uh, I don't know what he's growing in there so don't get me lying um, but anyway she over here why are you on the counter ma'am Nova Nova what are you doing you're letting what grow big the flowers Okay, so that requires you to be on the table? Yes. Okay. <laughs> anyway, my husband has no idea that I'm getting my hair done today. I told him I have an appointment, so hopefully he doesn't ask me what kind of appointment when I leave the house today. Yeah, he didn't ask me when I first told him, but I want to surprise him and come home with my hair all done up and stuff. So hopefully he does not ask when I leave because I don't know what I'm gonna say <laughs> I might just be like tell him maybe I'm just I'm, I'm going to get my ends trimmed or something like that and then come home with it done so anywho Carter has a football game later on tonight and I think that's about it football game hair appointment laundry a little bit of laundry not too much I hope you guys are doing well hope y'all's week is going good and I'm gonna talk to you guys in a little bit all right, TJ did not ask me any questions when I left. He was just like, all right, see you later. <laughs> so I think I'm good. Um, although he can track me because we have like our location on. So if he goes to my location, he'll know like the vicinity that I'm in. And he'll be like, well, what, what is she doing out there? Because this is not, I wouldn't even be coming here on a regular, on a random day. Uh, so anyways, but I do need to go. I'm going to get my hair done. So I'll show you guys afterwards. This is what it looks like now. I got to go pay for parking real quick and so that I'm not late. So got to go. Bye. All right, y'all, my hair is done, and it feels so good and weird that it's straight, but I love it. I'm gonna be, my neck gonna be hurting from flipping my hair around <laughs> all day. But she did a really good job. My hair is definitely a lot thinner than it was, uh, which is fine, but I, I mean, I'm okay with that. We just gotta work on getting it back, you know, to 100% healthy. I mean, it is. it does look healthy now. She cut a lot of my ends off they were very thin on the ends so she cut quite a bit off which you know like I, said, I don't I don't I'm not really into like the length anymore I just want health healthy hair so yeah anyways I'm on my way home TJ still doesn't know that I got my hair done and yeah we'll see his reaction and Noah's reaction and the boys reaction because none of them have seen me with straight hair, straight hair in so long but I'm gonna stay up on my trims. I'm gonna go back to her probably in January, she said, to get you know another deep condition and maintenance on my ends or whatever. And yeah, so I will try to record his reaction when he sees me. Around. <laughs> <laughs> I told him my neck is going to be hurting from, from me. Yes. Thank you. That's what I say. It looks healthy. She cut off a lot of my ends. 
So gray? Well, I've been has something. Oh, I see it. At the top? <gasps> That's, there's a lot. Is that a gray? No, the, and this is a gray too right here. Is that a gray? I like it. What do you mean you like it? No. There's one right here. That must have just came. I like it. What do you think? I'll make it be cute. When my head is gray? I don't know. I like this. Where's Nova? She's asleep. Josh calling you. All right, we're getting ready to go to Carter's game. That's a Kit Kat. Yes. We ate dinner. Well, they ate dinner. I didn't eat anything. My stomach feels like it's indigestion or something. I don't know. Like it's bloated. But I'm also getting ready to be on my cycle, so maybe that can be the issue too. Um, but we got. I got my bell. I got my Carter face. That was Mason's face. This is this is your face. For Mason's. I got my this. My little, hey, look, I'm being extra. I didn't even have to do all that. I just do it because my hair is done. Also, Chance is the only child that said, I like your hair, Mommy, without me having to say anything. I noticed it. No, you didn't say anything. You didn't say anything. Okay. And you didn't say anything, little girl. What? You look the same. Mommy, you look the same. Yeah. You look yes. the same. Yeah, look at her. Look at you. No, you're, no, she looks she's the same like you, and time. you are like Nova. I haven't had my hair like this in two years, Carter. No. Like, I'm being his game, like, let's go, Carter, let's go. <laughs> 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 no, you can do it too. Come on. You got her hair is like fluffed up now. All right, come on, flip let's your hair. Go, flip your hair. Flip your hair. Let's you got to do the hair thing. Flip it. You got to go like that. Look. Let's go, Carter. Go, you got to flip your hair. <laughs> Flip the <laughs> Yes. Do it again. Flip it. Let's, Let's go, Carter. Let's go. <laughs> yeah. No, yeah. Woo. Ring. You gonna ring the bell? And I'll be like this. Whoa. No. no. <laughs> All right. We're gonna drive 40 minutes away for this game. So you better win. You better. Oh, 40 minutes. You better win. We go. We gonna fingers crossed. We gonna win, y'all. Fingers crossed. Fingers, toes. Everything cross so that you can win. Look how cute he is. He's a cute little football player. Well, he, he did. You guys have beat this team before, so you could beat them again. Wait, yes. What is the team? I don't know. I don't know. But it's y'all. Be, y'all beat them before. So you could do it again. All right. What does it look like? Well, I don't know the colors. I don't know. We'll see when we get there. Then. All right. We gotta get ready to go. game as you can see if I can remember to put the clips in Carter no go ahead he went for the football game they won the football game finally huh what what finally boy yes y'all only won like two games three well two three three games now but no son y'all did not win four games yes he did no you did not Yes, you, you, okay, you I'm gonna let you think that. Time. But you, anyways, they won today. Like Carter got no, not Nova, not look at her. <laughs> not not her to show. Look, show me, show Carter how you how he was running for the touchdown. No, and, it wasn't. And how is and how he's supposed to run? You gotta look forward. I didn't do that. Just for like yeah, a quick I didn't second. Do this. Don't do that though. You can't look back. Carter be looking back when he's running to see if anybody's. Uh, you said it. You said you can look back for. That, that's 
cheating. No, I said that's what you did. You looked back for a second. That's cheating. It's not cheating, but yeah. It is. Okay. But don't. You don't need to look back because then it slows you down. It slows you down. Just look forward and just keep running. Okay. Run, Forrest, run. Huh? No, it's no run. Well, obviously, you will beat her because she's a three-year-old little girl. But are you listening to me? Are you listening to me? No. You're just going to run straight, right, and not look back. Okay. Okay. So, anyways, they, they won today. Carter got two touchdowns. And how many yes. flags did you get? Got a couple flags. Oh, my gosh. I need I need Okay. Go take a shower now. So, they won. So, that means that they have another game on Saturday. Yes. Uh, yes. And we, he got some money. We told him to get some money. Yeah, when it, when it's time to end the ball. So now, since they won tonight, they go, they have to pay on Saturday. If they were if they were to lose today, then it would have been the end of the season. So, yeah, we'll see how Saturday goes. Peace. Anyways, I don't know if I'm gonna make this a part two because I don't I don't know if there's enough vlog footage in today. So it might be another day that goes into it. So we'll see. If not, then we'll see you guys on the next video. Love you guys. Bye. Peace. Peace. And if not, then we'll see you guys in the next clip. Peace. Peace. Okay. Good morning. Oh, the battery's gonna die soon, but that's okay. I just dropped off Nova. A boy, they're at school, and I am going to go to Starbucks because I haven't eaten or had coffee, so that's what I want this morning. And then um, I'm gonna take Carter's glasses. His new glasses just came in. I'll show you guys in a second what they look like. I'm gonna drop them off to get them filled with their the correct prescription. All right. I'm in the Starbucks parking lot. I'm trying to be discreet because people be staring, like, looking at me like, who is she talking to? You know? Um, I shouldn't care because I've been do I've been vlogging, you know, how long have I been vlogging? Years. Over 10 years now. I would say over 10 because I got I gauge it off of Jaden, how old Jaden is because <clears throat> I know that's, we started before he was born and he's about to be 11. So, um, I just say like, you know, no, he is 11. So over 11 years. Anyways. Um, I should be used to it now, but sometimes I still be like, ooh, I don't want nobody to see me, to see me talking to a camera and be like, what's she doing? Um, anywho, just got Starbucks. I went inside. Y'all ever go to like, um, see if this man's looking at me now. Do y'all ever go to a restaurant or like a drive-thru and you see the line is long and then you be like, okay, I'm gonna go inside and see if I make it out before this car and the last, at the end of the line. That's what I did. But I can't really, I don't even know, I can't tell if the car that was at the end of the line is still in line or not because it like wraps around the building. I can't see behind the building where, where I'm at right now. Anyways, I got an iced chai, tea, cold. Oh, iced, obviously. But it's not as good as the one that I had yesterday. <laughs> this is just ice. That's what the, what's in there. Uh, this one was from the Starbucks and Target, but I didn't go to Starbucks and Target today. So I don't know how you mess up an iced chai. I'm not sure why was different but whatever i'm still gonna drink it then i also got some oatmeal anyways car's glasses i'm gonna go drop them off after i pick up some gas but these are the glasses that i was telling you guys about they're like indestructible look they, they stretch they're supposed to do that and then they just go right back in place so yeah hopefully they last longer they're like durable you know the brand they just don't have their brand oh sheen kelly she s h e e n kelly kids and tj ordered uh two pair this pair and then i think like a green and black pair that haven't came in yet and so um yeah i'm gonna go get them prescriptive for him it takes like a week i think for them to come in and hopefully these will last longer than the other ones these are pretty cool whoever designed these it's a good idea to they're like yeah yeah. All right, I'm gonna eat my breakfast. Okay, let me eat my food. Okay, I'm home. Dropped off Carter's glasses. They said it'll take like seven to 10 days. And then I went to Lowe's because I am impulsive. And the the green paint, the green wall in, Nova, in Carter's room is driving me crazy. Like every time I go in there, I'm like, ugh, why did I pick this color? So um, I decided I'm gonna change it to a black wall. And yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. And I'm sure some of y'all gonna be like, well, why are you gonna change stuff in your house if you're gonna be moving eventually? Um, yes, it's true, but why not do it? You know, like we still here. Why can't I do it? Why, you know, whatever. 
Plus, I, you know, who knows how long it's gonna take for us to move in that house. Like it could be a year. I'm pretty sure it would be a year by the time they start building um, for it to be complete. And I'm not gonna look at that green color for another year. So, and it's just one, one wall anyway. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm about to do. Well, I don't know if I'm gonna do it now. Uh, I don't know, we'll see. Sorry, his room is a mess right now. But anyways, this green, I'm not feeling it anymore. And every time I walk into this room, like I said, I'm like, this is not a vibe, you know? You know what I mean? You know, you know, you know what I mean. Like when you walk into a room and you be like, I just love this room, you know what I mean? Like it makes me happy. This room ain't given what it's supposed to give. So, um, what is that? I don't know what that is. Anywho, so I'm gonna paint the wall black and I'm not really feeling that sign anymore. So I'll probably take that down to remove it. And also, um, so Chance has his name on the wall already. And since he got a bigger bed, that C won't fit anymore. So I might just take this C right here and put it on Carter's wall. You know, since he already has his name. Um, and then maybe I'll get a different picture up there. I don't know. I mean, it's already an accent wall, so he might not need anything there. Anyways. So, um, yeah, I think I might start it. It shouldn't take me long. It's only one wall, right? I guess we'll see. I don't remember how long it took. Well, it took us a long time to do this because we also had did the pattern in the back too when we first did it. So, uh, yeah, let's see if I want to start this now. I think I do. Because I'm crazy. TJ looked at me like, what you about to do? And he saw me come inside the house with the paint. <laughs> All right, I got my hair clipped up. I don't want to get paint in my hair, but I'm done. My hands hurt now. Ouch. But I'm letting it the room dry. I'll show you guys it in a second. I'm eating these protein chips. I taste black beans. That's what I taste. I ordered some things for his room, too. Let me show you guys. So I ordered him this thing to hang up his medals, because right now they're just sitting on his nightstand and his trophies. You can put the trophies on top. I ordered this frame that will put that I'll put his um, this picture of LeBron James poster in. So we can hang that up. Ordered him a uh oh a basketball comforter set, two new lamps because his are broken, and then this little basketball throw pillow, which will all be here. the The comforter won't be here until this weekend, but everything else will be here. What's today? Oh, tomorrow. Everything else will be here tomorrow. So, now his room will definitely be a vibe. It wasn't even dry yet, and I was like, oh, this looks so much better. Like, I really was just annoyed every time I walked into the room. Was that just me that happens? Like, that, that feels that way? Like, you just, yeah. I know it's not just me. Because you know why? Because my husband changes his, room, his office around 50 million times. So I know he knows what it feels like to walk into a room and it's not, it ain't it. So yeah. I'll show you guys in a second what it looks like. My hands hurt. All right, done with this room for now until I get the stuff in. Um, yeah, so you can see the wall looks so much better. So yeah, so I'll get the comforter in. Then you can see like the lamp is broken. The, his new lamps will come in. I'm gonna switch up some of the pictures and that's it. So, hey, what you doing? Putting on my clothes. How's your room? Good. This is the reason for the season. What? Just look. <laughs> you don't see anything? Oh my. I just noticed. <laughs> Boy, you've been in this room, dang, <laughs> about an hour long. I didn't notice it. This is ridiculous. He <laughs> just knows. Oh, Welcome to dog. I didn't know this. Do you like it? Yeah. Yeah. But I need to guide the different. I didn't know this. I know you didn't. That's why I came in here to get <laughs> See how you felt about it because you didn't say anything. <laughs> okay. What's wrong, Nova? <laughs> she don't know either. You like his room? Do you like his room? 
Car's room. Have, have your back. Go. Kind of? <laughs> okay. Good morning. It is the next day. And I did not finish vlogging yesterday because yesterday evening I was beyond irritated. <laughs> beyond irritated with like certain things that kept happening. And so I was I I was in a mood. I was in a mood. Even though I was really trying my hardest not to be in a mood because I knew, and you know, today reminded me that you know certain things can will happen, and you know, in life, in life in general, and that that's out of our control, right? And so I know, I knew I couldn't control what happened or what happens, but I can control how I react to those those things happening and so I kept saying that in my head and I kept praying like Lord please give me the patience and um, you know just guide me to get me through this time you know I'm giving it to you Lord please just help me right now <laughs> be in a better mood whatever I, I was just really irritated and just in a funk but I'm better now went to sleep and I'm good now. And then also last night, before I went to bed, we saw that Simone Biles posted Nova's story on her Instagram. So if you don't have Instagram, I had did a video with Nova a while ago. Oh, I didn't even do a video. Like I was recording, recording so I can record some of her gymnastic stuff. But it just was like a random in the moment thing that happened. I was, put, I was setting up her beam and Nova was trying to do a cartwheel on the beam while I'm like setting up the beam or whatever and she farted and y'all know Simone got Simone Biles is her girl y'all know that she loves she loves her that she's like obsessed with her that's her girl um and so she farted and after right after she she farts she like thinks for a second and she's like mommy does Simone Biles fart <laughs> and you know of course I tell her yes you know everybody farts and so I had posted that on my Instagram I don't know maybe like a couple weeks ago and for whatever reason, it's like everybody's posting it now. And I guess Simone Biles saw it on another page and she shared it on her on her stories and also commented on that video, whatever, um, was like with laughing emoji, emojis and hearts and said, this is so cute. Watch this. Um, watch this video. So me and Nova were like stoked yesterday. We were so excited because somebody had messaged me. I didn't see it from her on her page initially, like the first time like on her page, I saw it because somebody sent it to me. And I was like, wait, what? Huh? And I showed Nova and I wasn't even recording her reaction because it was just in the moment. And I tried to check the um, our living room cameras, but it like cut off, right? Um, like as we were getting excited. So I can't, I can't even show you guys her reaction. But I um, posted a clip after the fact, like talking to her and I asked her how she felt about Simone Biles posting her video. Nova was like, so good. <laughs> uh, and it was so crazy that it was a coincidence that Nova had on the Simone Biles, one of Simone Biles' leotards with the goat on it. She wore that yesterday, same day that Simone posted her, posted her video. So I was like, this is so sweet. I love this for Nova. So sweet. So this is Nova yesterday. She was wearing that. So it has a goat on it, obviously, because Simone is the greatest of all time. Um, and then it has Simone's like little signature on it on her on her Leo. And then here is the you can see Simone shared it. So cute. And then her comment or whatever right there on the video. So I thought that was really awesome, and that definitely put me in a better mood. Um, and then yeah. That was it. So super, super, I'm, I'm good now. But just remember, if, for anybody out there, don't let situations put you in a mood. You can't control the situations, but you can control how you, how you react to them. Message of the day. But anyways, I need to drink some coffee and eat some breakfast and stuff because I have not done that yet and also edit the vlog so it can go up. So I hope you guys enjoyed today's video and we will see you guys on the next one. Love you guys. Peace.